Hundreds of acres of land in West Bainbridge will be rezoned from rural residential to heavy and light industrial. I'm AJ Douglas in Bainbridge, and I've been tracking how area leaders are assessing not one, but two applications to rezone plans that have just never been developed before. The city approved the Planning Commission's recommendation to approve a revised zoning change application. Commission's recommendations, I don't ever say aye. Aye. The opposed? Rick McCaskill is the Development Authority's executive director who made the now approved revision. He initially requested to rezone 350 acres of rural residential to heavy industrial. That application was pulled by applicant McCaskill, but a new revised application followed. The Planning Commission felt that this was a much better uh, presentation and a much better plan. Uh, they approved it unanimously. When people living in the West Bainbridge neighborhood first learned of the proposed rezoning changes this past summer, several spoke against the project. How is this going to impact us with noise? How is this going to affect um, a lot of us that are actually bordering right on the line? During the most recent city council meeting, no one spoke against the new rezoning request. In a statement, McCaskill explains why he believes the new plan will grow industry while accommodating bordering neighbors' needs. We have modified the zoning request to better reflect what we intend to do. This will also look much better to neighboring properties because we have included a vegetative buffer and only allow light industry, such as warehousing near the neighbors. Caskell says that the key reason to expand the industrial park is to provide more space for any existing industry looking to expand. In Bainbridge, I'm AJ Douglas for ABC 27.